Hello guys, welcome on a new tutorial on Spark AR. This time I want to show you how to make real fast this uh, really cool effect, like Kira Kira effect. It's really cool right now. So, to get started, let's open a new project. We're gonna go to add assets and import from Spark AR library. We go on patch assets. We're gonna need a couple of things. We import these adjust colors and the triton color. Then we're gonna need the um, camera texture and a rectangle. Put it to full size and uh, create a material. Then we go on the material, turn it flat, and click on texture. All right, let's patch it. We throw everything inside the patch editor. We connect the RGB. No, wait a second. We do the opposite. So, camera texture to Triton shader and then adjust color to diffuse texture. This is what we, we got. Same from the other tutorial. But here is the trick. So, we go on Google. Let's find a cool image we like, or a sequence, a GIF, whatever you like. I'm gonna go with a glitch texture as always. Let's find a cool one without banners and, st and stuff. Like this one. Alright, so let's import the image we just downloaded. Import from computer. That's it. So we can do this thing with just the image, static image, just like this. You put the image, you drag it into the patch editor, and you start connecting it in the highlight color, midtone color, shadow color. And you start messing with it. You see what is happening? And here is the trick, basically. Then you can just do whatever you like with it. Change the highlight threshold, shadow threshold, until you like it. You can mess with the edges color shader, invert, mess with brightness, contrast, whatever you see, and that little patch. Then what I want to show you, we can also create a new animation sequence and turn this image we already have from single texture to sprite shit. And uh, we're gonna put this image in our animation sequence. Now we drag the animation sequence and we can use it with or without our image as showed before. We turn the velo velocity down a little bit, mess with the parameters in sprite sheet uh, on the right side. We have just one columns because it's one image, so we gotta mess with rows and sprites until we find something cool. We can mix them up together. I'm just trying to like connect more of the tutorial I have already made. Like this technique you can find in my old tutorial and just mix it up like this. 
and this is really we we it's like we, we got a tank spark ar for this update because it's really massive and easy to use so see you can put the same camera texture inside the shadow color and the highlight color and just keep the mid-tone color with your sequence or you can throw the camera texture inside the shadow color and just just mess with it and find uh, something you like something cool okay i'm transferring it to my phone to see how it looks from my phone i'm gonna put a short video of it for you so you can see and uh, that's it just have fun with this effect and uh, let me know in comment if you like this tutorial and you want to see more and uh, show me what you do with it have a good one see you soon <laughs>